But you guys got another video here for you. Why you should update your router firmware regularly. Yes, you should update your router firmware on a regular basis. Router firmware often includes security patches that will protect your network from vulnerabilities. And that can also improve performance and compatibility in that router. So why update your router firmware? Simply security reasons. Firmware updates often address security vulnerabilities protecting your network from potential threats and hackers. There's also performance uh, enhancements with firmware updates. So updates can improve your router's performance, potentially leading to a faster and more stable internet speeds. You're also getting better compatibility. So firmware updates can also ensure your router works smoothly with new devices and technologies. Bug fixes are a common problem with routers and without patching or updating the firmware, updates can resolve a lot of these bugs and issues that you may be uh, having with your router. And also some of the functionality uh, might not be working properly and updates can definitely fix this. So how often should you update your uh, router? Well, on a regular basis, if possible, if they're offering you uh, regular firmware updates, it's good practice to check for updates every few months or whenever you notice an issue with your network performance. So critical updates should be kept an eye on as well, and these should be updated immediately. If a critical security update is released, it's important to install them as soon as possible. Manufacturers' recommendations, check your router's documentation or manufacturer's website for specific recommendations on update frequency. And they should give you all the information you need. You can either manually download the file and update it that way, or you can just use the update button on most routers nowadays. If you've got an ISP router, it's more than likely controlled by the ISP when they roll out firmware updates. But as a third party router, you can come in and browse for that file and update it, or you can just check for updates by using the check for updates button. Make sure you're downloading the right firmware for that uh, actual model of router, and you should be pretty much good to go. Remember, at the end of the day, it's one of the things that probably people overlook, and it's a really key part of your internet connection and network. So make sure you keep it updated. If you're wondering why I'm not responding to your comments, that is because I'm on holiday right now. And hopefully when I get back, I can resume with full videos. These are just quick videos that I made before I left just to give you guys something to watch. Anyway, with that said, I think that's going to be about it. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Big shout out to my YouTube members. I really do appreciate the support and I shall catch you in the next one. Bye for now.